Hey everyone, in this video I will show you how simple it is to create and promote your own private Web2 social network. Your time investment is under 10 minutes where you can create exactly what you see here on this graphic but as you'll see with a lot more sites than what we had space for in this graphic. So let's get straight into it. Hi everyone, very happy to announce the release of our new Web2 Pyramid module in our Evo Pro SEO software. What that means is you can now create your own Web2 private networks that are full with only very high page rank, high authority websites. So when, when you create this network, it's going to provide your money sites with tons and tons of powerful links though more so we can then send links to this private net network you've created with more direct anchor tanks links giving your network the context of the money site that you're promoting thus pushing you up the rankings in Google. In this tutorial I will show you how to make number one how to make your private network and then once we've created it I'll come back and then I'll show you how to promote it. It's very very simple. Okay, so we'll get right into it. We will now create a private network. So you click on new project and it will be Peter Drew tutorial. And I like to put mains only in here so I know that it's just the mains that I'm creating. Click on OK. That brings up our wizard and I just enter in the data. Website URL RSS feed main tags. Oops. Select a category, and I'll choose business, generate an account name. Now here is where we check the Web2 Pyramid box. If you click on the question mark it brings up the expl explanation of to use it or to not. Select my static accounts. These, this is where the keywords go that point to your money site from the private network. Once that's done click on next. Select articles. As you already know, I'm sure that you can put the same keyword phrase in again and again, and you will get a different lot of articles from our database with Unique Article Wizard who spin these articles on a paragraph level. Click next. I use the same as I've got here for there. Now I need to put this information here because the software won't move forward unless I've got information there. We leave these empty because these are the links that go on high page rank sites but we're not making them now so we click next. These are all the, all the sites we have in our private Web2 network that we're creating. You'll see the results of, of the page rank etc from the results after we've created this project. So here we're just creating the main so we unselect all and only select the main Web2 authority sites. So it's really as simple as that. I've seen tons of SEO services out there making a lot more inferior Web2 networks for pretty much the same price that we charge per month to make these though you can only supply one or two URLs and a bunch of keywords. You can see how quick it was for me to make that. You can imagine how many of these you could make per month. So I'll go ahead and start this job. Once it's finished, I will come back and continue on with the tutorial. Save. It's got my mains only, so I know that it's the mains only. Okay. 
click on start and off we go. I'll be back once this is finished, probably in under an hour. So we are back and the software is finished creating your private Web2 network. And this is what they look like. This is our stats report, which you can obviously save to CSV and PDF. These are the these, this is the top level domain so that your network was created on. .biz, .com, .co.uk, .au, .net, and .edu. So we've got a really nice diversity of TLDs in your blog network. This is the page rank of the domains that your um, private network network was created on. These are the rankings over here, so you've got we've got a whole nice variation. We've got a lot of PR6s, PR8s, these are unknown, PR4s, a couple of PR3s, but that's looking very, very healthy. Here we show the links to each of the individual wikis, social sites, or blogs that you're that are part of your private network. You can log, log into these at any time and add additional links if you like once these gain more power and authority over the net in the search engines. These are the RSS links created that are pointing to your private network. Here we list the individual pages, each of these got an article on it. So that's your full report there which you can save and back up to your hard drive. So now I'll close this and I'll show you how to rerun this project. So I will close this, move to archive. Now say I'm coming back in a couple of days to add more links to that project. So I will go new project, choose project from archive. load project and promote previously created web2 pyramid project. So I'm back where I was now this time. I'll, what I forgot to mention previously is of course you can add your own unique articles. Here I'll select some other articles. Now since we're promoting the um, private network, the links that we normally promote here oh, and we drop on the high page rank sites, these all go back to your private link network and it does that automatically for you. This time I, I keep it all selected and if I missed any main sites in the previous run it will create them for you this time. So I'll start that and come back once it's completed. When you save, I'll add done so I know that it's done. And start. I'll be back once it's completed to show you the results. Okay, so there we have it. Project's completed. Now I will show you the results of the work that we've just done. Click on show statistics. And here you can see the different types of domains that we've created links on pointing to your private Web2 network. They are all down here. .orgs, a whole bunch, 17.9%. edu, 7%. .net, .com .au. .co.uk, .com, obviously there's a lot of those, .biz, so we've got a whole range of diversity of TLDs pointing to our private network. Here we see the page rank. Got a whole bunch of PR7s over here in grey. We've got PR9s in there too. whole bunch of PR8s. So look, 
this is re really really healthy your private network is going to gain a lot of strength and authority in the websites the more you promote links over them now here we have the individual links we've created these are the links on the main main sites high page rank high authority sites here created tons of those these are the RSS links the second lot or third lot that we've created we promote the RSS links plus for sites that don't have RSS links we create RSS links for them and then promote those RSS links scrolling down these are the individual links that we've created on indiv individual pages and down the, down the bottom we have the wiki sites that we've created links on pointing back to our private network each time you load the software you get a different 10 high page rank high authority wiki sites a lot of them on EDUs loaded into your system we have them stored in our database and each time you load the software we randomly choose 10 so to give you a, a, vast, a vaster distribution So all up to create your private network and then promote it that's a time investment of under 10 minutes you can create as many of these private networks as you like there are three options now using Evo Pro to promote your website one a typical Evo Pro run to promote your website two create private networks to promote your money site or three do both this is exactly what I do your Evo Pro membership comes with two licenses I mean you can run the software on two computers in theory you could create and promote between 200 and 250 of these per month for your single Evo Pro membership your one dollar trial comes with one license so you can test it out if you haven't tried this membership yet you can create everything you've seen in this video right now for just one buck thanks for your time see you next time